hello guys and welcome to the gaining access section so uh, all the attacks we did before uh, in the pre-connection uh, attack section uh, those attacks can be done without connecting to the uh, to the internet or connecting to the Wi-Fi actually so we don't know the Wi-Fi password and we we can still manage to uh, to capture the packets and we can still read some information into them uh, but we cannot do a lot of stuff because all of that is encrypted so what we are going to do in this section is trying to hack those Wi-Fi's so we are going to uh, gain the access actually uh, so we can do a lot of more stuff because once we are on the network we can do a lot of stuff and we can run even more powerful attacks by being the part of the network uh, and then it will be more easy for us to see the data which which is being sent uh, through the packets and and if it's an open network uh, i mean that if there is no encryption on those data packets and you see that uh, it is open network and it is not wep or it is not wpa or wpa2 or any other kind of encryption so you can just skip uh, skip these videos of the of the gaining access section and you can just jump uh, jump to the post connection attacks because uh, in this section we are only going to discuss how to buy, uh, how to hack wi-fi and how to gain access and how to how to break the uh, break the keys and how to crack the keys and all that stuff so uh, if the network is using any kind of encryption and it means that it is asking for a password so it is asking for a decrypting password so we need to hack it actually and we need to uh, we need to uh, do stuff which uh, by which we can actually uh, capture the key or or do uh, some stuff to get into the net, get into the network actually so our sole purpose in this section is going to be uh, part of of becoming the part of the network so there are actually three type of uh, encryptions which are being used in wi-fi's uh, and uh, these are followed all around the world uh, number one is wep uh, it is also called web and it is not uh, very widely used but you can still find some wi-fi's or, or some networks using web and then there is wpa and wpa2 wpa and wpa2 are uh, kind of very similar and all the attacks you can run on wpa you can also run them on wpa2 uh, so uh, in the next section we are going to uh, discuss how we can hack into web and and how to capture packets and how to generate IVs and all that stuff.